The D man. Yeah, shout out my nigga from D's Media. You feel me? <laughs> Yo, it's your boy D's Media back again with another video. Like, comment, subscribe to the channel on a rail to 100K. Today, we're going to talk about Tay Town Ken Ken arrested for a failure to register as a sex offender. Let's jump straight into it. Uh, OTF slash Tay Town Ken Ken um, was just arrested recently uh, for failure to register as a um, sex offender. He also got additional charges. Um, he must have got caught with a magazine or something like that. Because as you can see on the screen, it says bullet mag. That's that's the magazine. But um, yeah, man, this this is a bad look for uh, OTF and Lil Dirt. Um, I feel like at the end of the day, I know Lil Dirt want to be loyal to his homie and shit like that and back him up and co-sign him and, you know, um, just give him that OTF stamp. You know, uh, he also is a rapper, uh, Ken Ken is, so, you know, by Lil Dirt being his man, you know, you, you need that stamp. But for Lil Dirt behalf, by you having multi-million dollar sponsors, you know, you just recently, uh, what, last year signed a $40, 40 million dollar record deal with Sony slash Alamo. You know, uh, you got different products out, you know, you, you, you own commercials and stuff like that. This is the type of PR that uh that'll make you lose sponsors, contracts, and stuff like that because no one want to be tied to something like that. Whether if it's true or if it's not true, we don't know. That's only Ken Ken, the woman, and the the individuals that involve. Um, you know, even though he was found guilty, you never know what happened. Um, like I say, I'm not here to say he guilty or not guilty, but I'm just saying that looked real bad on Lil Dirt behalf. Because the first thing they're going to say is, Lil Dirt homie, OTF, OTF, you get what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, even though Dirt had nothing to do with it, and I'm pretty sure by him having daughters, he don't agree with it or condone it, it looks bad by you kind of co-signing it. By him being signed to your label or under your label, and you, uh, you know, supporting his music and just supporting him as a friend because you knew this dude from, from the beginning. You know, that will make you look bad. And and I just wouldn't do it. You know, I get it. You want to be loyal to your homie and stuff like that. And you can. But I'm saying if you talk about running a multi-million dollar record label and you talking about the brand, the little dirt, I don't think that that's a good look to have that around you. But at the end of the day, you know, dirt for the trenches, you know, he for his homies that that less fortunate, you know, he try to bring everybody with him. You know, he try to turn people into stars like he did with King Von and other other artists. But on this one, bro, I would have to let Ken Ken, you know, go his own separate way. You know, like I said, we I, I don't know if it's true or not. I wasn't there. He was found guilty of it, obviously, if he had to register. But that don't mean that he was guilty. But at the end of the day, on Lil Dirt behalf, I'ma say again, it doesn't look good. It kind of looks like you co-signed it or like you agree with it. Even though, like I said, you know, that was your homie before, you know, y'all grew up in the trenches, you know. But at the end of the day, me personally, I just wouldn't co-sign it or I just wouldn't back it because at the end of the day, if you're looking at it from a brand standpoint, nobody's gonna wanna do no business with you. Nobody's gonna wanna do nothing with you if they feel like your name is attached to that, you know. Um, that's why, like, a lot of times Lil Dirt support Ken Ken, but he doesn't really... Well, no, a couple times publicly he has, but he don't really be in a lot of Dirt videos and all of that. And this is why I believe why, you know, but um, still. But like I say, by him being an affiliate of OTF, Lil Dirt is going to catch that bad PR behind that. So that's just my opinion. But your boy uh, OTF slash Taytown Ken Ken was just arrested for failure to register as a sex offender in Chicago. Y'all let me know in the comment section what y'all think. The D man. Yeah, shout out my nigga from D's Media. You feel me? <laughs>